Hey guys, what's up? It's the HD Tech Buzz here today with another app to page you. If you haven't seen any of the previous episodes, go ahead and click on the link in the top right hand corner and it'll take you to a playlist with all these awesome apps in them that I've reviewed so far. So anyway, we're going to be talking about end pulls. So I'm going to open up end pulls and whenever you open up end pulls, you're going to have to make an account. So you could probably guess by the name, end pulls is an app where you get paid to fill out surveys and stuff like that. Polls, you answer questions. That's what a poll is. After you make your account, it's going to look a lot like this, except there's going to be polls available to you. Now, there are no polls available to me at the time because I filled them out already. End pulls creates polls and then distributes them to you guys and you only have a certain amount of time to complete the polls and then after a certain amount of time they're going to shut down the polls and they're not going to be available for you to answer or get money from and some polls you don't qualify for it'll ask you uh, pre-survey questions to see if you qualify for the poll or not and if you don't you can't you aren't valid and you can't receive money for the poll but anyway like I said after you sign up for your account, it's going to take you to this polls tab. It's the second tab out of the five tabs on the bottom. But let's go ahead and look into the app a little bit more. And then there's a refresh button here at the top that you can refresh to see if there's any more polls available. Let's go over to the news tab. This is just the news for the app and everything. And then over at the results tab, these are all the polls that have ever been made by end polls. And notice that some of them are closed, closed 68 days ago, you know, stuff like that. That's what I mean. After a while, they'll close the polls if you don't answer them. And looks like I missed this one. I didn't answer or it looks like it was made and then closed the day after. So sometimes it's a good idea to uh, go ahead and get on end polls, you know, once a day just to see if there's any polls because some of them shut down pretty quickly and then you can look through the results of the polls. And there's answer by you. This one's still ongoing, the Facebook one that I answered, and your polls, I guess you can make your own. And that's what the Create tab is. You can make your own polls. And then the settings is just your profile and all that stuff, your payout, how much you've made. I haven't really made all that much. I made 10 cents. You need $10 to cash out to PayPal. So it's kind of standard for all apps like this. You need $10 to be able to cash out. And that's pretty much it for this app. I don't have much else to say. You guys can explore it. It's basically a survey application, and I'll see you later.